Oh, GHCB here. I guess this is going to be part two of the ADSB. And the first part, I, um, I showed you uh, this little device here, which is the Hammer ha Nova DVB T stick with the RTL 2832 chip and an E4000 tuner. Um, I showed you that I was decoding using um, um, Ubuntu under, running under a virtual. PC um, using GNU radio and also using um, oh, I forget what it's called anyway <laughs> refer to the first video uh, but I'm, I'm using this command here anyway for, for plain plotter because I didn't cover plain plotter in the first video so that's just producing uh, output as we can see here and that's actually scrolling up now in real time so that's looking at the ADS-B data on 1090 megahertz or 1.09 gigahertz and uh, we minimize that you can see we've got plane plotter running here there's a there's a plane there just going over the hills um, there's another one there let's have a look that's at 30,000 feet this one's 16,350 and climbing. Now if I go to this one, I can go to um, flight deck view. Well, I've already got that selected. And if we go to the plane plotter directory, we'll find a file in there. So we're under the program files at x86COAA plane plotter. Plane plotter. You'll find a file there called Google underscore cockpit dot KML. That that will show you. The, um, the cockpit view. Um, I'm just going to stop this and show you what you need to do in order to enable it. I'll do that slowly actually. I went to uh, options, then IO settings, and I've got that mode S stroke ADSB uh, SBS 1 slash RB V3 TCP selected, and I've got Google Earth server enabled on the, the default ports and the other thing I've done is I've gone into options mode S receiver uh, kinetic SBS family and then SBS1 dash BS IP address I've put the IP address of my Ubuntu server capturing the ADSB data Okay, so that, that's the setup. I'm just going to click the green button up there to start processing again. So that this this one that's just going out of range. If I go flight deck view, OK. So I'll show you that again. I don't think I was looking straight at it there. And I ticked flight deck view in there, and then I went to OK. It's just going off the map there. But anyway, if we go back to the um, the program folder. COAA plane plotter and double click on the uh, google underscore cockpit.kml and then um, we'll get a cockpit view of that plane and it will move uh, but I'll, because I'm only getting the updates every time we get data from the plane which is about every second it just shunts google earth along you can see it moving then just wait again, as soon as it gets the next piece of data it'll give us the cockpit view there we go forward again um, I'm just going to see if there's any landing oh, I think that one there is taking off let's have a look at that, ok that it should Go and fly to the cockpit of that other plane I've just selected then. And it gets a bit of data from it. He says, come on. Yeah, here we go. It's going to the point of view of the cockpit of that other plane that I selected. She's uh, looking at Sandbatch at the moment. And it's updating again. I'll see if I can find one that's uh, actually landing. No, there's absolutely nothing around the uh, the 
Manchester Airport region. Okay, in that case, I'll just show you one more thing. I mean, I'm not into plane spotting. Um, I only started looking at this yesterday. Um, so have a look at that flight there. If have a look at the flights. They give us um, a unique, what they call ICAOID. That one's 406402. If we go to this website here, um, www.airframes.org slash reg slash e i e n k and we put that number in there so let's remind me what it, what it was it's uh, 406402 put that in there 406402 that's a unique address I'll submit that and it comes back with this, we've got a Boeing 747-87UF, whatever that is. Registration G-GSSE. And you can see we've got a nice picture of the plane. So it's a, it's a BA World plane there. Um, and that's all it's going to give us, actually. Other than that, we know that that's flying as BAW3577. If we have a look, look up that. So uh, BAW3577. Let's see, see what that comes up with. Oh yeah, flight status for British Airways 3577. Uh, oh, Frankfurt to Chicago. Okay. <laughs> What's it doing there then? I guess it's flying over from uh, from, from Frank Frankfurt. Anyway, that's enough of that. So you, you get the idea. GHCB.